Howdy ho, neighbor. Day 1150 for me. And day 32 for John, I believe. If I did my math right. <clears throat> so, yeah. Anyhow, it was buggy shop day today. Friday, buggy shop day. <sighs> and yawn day, apparently. So, progress report is... Got the shifter mounted in there. Backwards. That's park right there. And then you go forward for drive. That's okay. Because, you know, shifter cable goes to the back instead of the front. Made the mount for this guy. It's not... Just got to put some nuts on it. The old steering brakes. So, that's ready to go. Except for, I got to run the brake line still. Oh. Made the old fuel uh, pump unit right here. Got a few things. Got to hook a drain on the bottom. Just got to put a fitting in here for the fuel feed. Pump goes right here. I'm going to put a return port in there also. So that uh, the return coming off the injection, I'll tee it so it can go into the tank or into the fuel tank. You know. That's just how it goes. Keep her, keep that thing full of fuel. That's the plan. Uh, yeah, got that sorted out pretty good. Oh yeah, put the radiator mounts in right here. One there and one over there. So it's gonna sit right here. Gotta do the upper, you know, hanger deals, but that's no big deal. Uh, did the battery box over here. Yep, right there, battery box. Mm -hmm. And put the hold downs in, so good, nice and secure. Tuck the seat out. That's much nicer. Put the seat out. A lot easier to work. Should be interesting getting it back in, because it was a struggle getting it out. But we'll get her. Oh, yeah. I'll, I don't care. I'll sit on a milk crate if I have to. Yeah, whatever it takes. No, I'll we'll get it. No big deal. Anyway, uh, yeah. Spent a lot of time on the fuel tank thing. More time than I wanted to. But, sometimes that's how it goes. <sighs> Pardon me. Anyways, yeah. That's that. It's coming along. So we gotta do the rear end alignment and I got some stuff to do still. But got Oh, got a day and a half. The cats are fighting. Neighbor cats are fighting. They like doing that. But anyway. Yeah. So hope you had a great day. I did. And uh I drank too many Mountain Dews. Just saying. I can admit it. I need to quit, though, because I think my kidney's kind of not liking it. So I'm go drink a bunch of water, flush her out. You know, tomorrow's a new day, and maybe we won't drink so much Mountain Dew tomorrow. I'm just saying that's going to be the case. Anyway. So, yeah, good stuff. Like I said, hope you had a good day. Great day, really. And uh, thanks for checking in. Thanks for the love and support and the prayers. Especially for John and myself. Transplant victims. Not really victims. What's a better word for that? I don't want to. Victim's not the right word. Because, uh, you know, we're pretty thankful for the transplant. So I would say we are transplant receivers. Clearly. Thankful receivers. How about that? We're thankful transplant receivers. So, anyways, thanks for the prayer. <laughs> uh, keep looking up. Keep being thankful. Keep waving at your neighbors. And, uh, kids, love you guys. Grandkids. Well, kind of only got one. Anyway, uh, what else? 
I don't know. I guess that's it. I hope you wake up tomorrow singing and smiling, thanking God for the day, and get ready for a great day. It's going to be a great day, Saturday. I kind of want to go riding. Well, I do want to go riding, but got to finish the buggy. Else the dune strip's not going to be very fun. Still be fun, but not as, you know what I mean. Anyhow, so, we'll get the buggy finished. Hopefully tomorrow I'll finish her up. That's pretty optimistic, but, you know, I'm an optimistic guy, so. So I gotta do exhaust, too. That's the fun part, though. It's not that noisy, though. I can get away with no exhaust. But I'll do it anyway. Anyhow. Okay. So, don't forget to thank God for all your blessings. And you take some time, count them up. It's always a good thing. Uh, yeah. Have a great day. We'll talk to you tomorrow. Love you guys. Later on.